to the Geek Group. It's time for viewer mail at 1400 hours, and I have a box. I also have no blocking monitor today, so this is just kind of weird. It's just, it's just me looking at the intake tube to the internet. It is not a note. It is, it is a gripper. Okay. The Gur Ripper, the safest, most precise push block with a moving blade guard. Total control of the workpiece virtually eliminates kickback. Works small stock safely with precise quarter inch thin rip cuts. It's been on our wish list forever. I have no idea who got it, but thank you. Moose is so very happy. Here. For a band saw? Table saw. It's okay. for band saw. Hold round tables. On the, and the most dangerous tool in the wood shop, the joiner. Okay. This is from Sam's Club. It's an HP thing. It's, it's from Denichi. I'm guessing it's toner? Uh -huh. Or something? It's paper. It's paper in a roll. It's a roll of paper. This was also on our Okay, you have a plan for this? Yeah. I want to see you get that into the big print. That'd be kind of cool. Thank you, Denichi. Ooh, this is heavy. It may go someplace is, unnatural, but... <laughs> this is also from Denichi. It feels like paper. It's a good day for me for you. Yes. Yeah, this is, this beer mail is all about the office stuff. It's from Dick Blick. This is also from Denichi. Also from Denichi. Wait, this was too, I think. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. It's all Denichi. Yeah. They're framed. Yes. Moose, you've been framed. Should I open this or should I leave it in? Please leave it. Okay. I have a deal. Here. It says fragile on the box. And he throws it. It's a lot of frames. It's a five pack, I think. Six. It is, it is rather a lot of frames that I will not take out because I will get in trouble. This is for art. Making the building look nicer and more professional. Yeah. Okay, cool. That's all I got in there. It's a frame. It fits the paper. Oh. Matting for those? It's paper for those. We put that in the big printer. I got it now. I'm smart! Thank you, Denichi. That's your mail for today. We will be back after this. Quinn's Vape Supply is your source for high-quality e-cig products. At Quinn's, you'll find over 80 different flavors of e-liquids, from exotic fruit flavors to traditional tobacco flavors, and everything, everything in between. between. There's an e-liquid for everyone. Quinn's is also the exclusive supplier of the Chris Bowden Signature Series. Not sure which flavor's for you? Check out one of the Flavor Flights for a sampling of different flavors. All e-liquids have customizable nicotine. nicotine levels ranging from 0 to 24 milligrams, so you can control how much nicotine, nicotine you're vaping. Quinn's is an authorized Inokin dealer, and they carry a variety of e-cigs and accessories. Quinn's has everything you need to vape exactly how you like. Quinn's Vape Supply is exclusively online, and they offer priority mail shipping for all domestic orders. So head on over to QuinnsVapeSupply.com. That's Q-U-I-N-N-S, vapesupply.com, and start vaping right today. I learned absolutely nothing from it. Not there yet? Coming out. Why are you coming out? Oh, I need to get a walk. No, I'm just tightening it down for now. I'm just going to get a little bit closer. Better than you happy? Yep. Jesus. Is there any steering control on Hell no! I'm the mom. You 
controls by leaning. I'm going to hit that workbench. Like, Chris, okay. Yes, Yes, choose. Now do you see why you would notice when this is on? It's much louder in life than it is on the block. Well, this is quiet. You see how his wheels turn? Kind of this is how he dies. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go put some load through the batteries real quick, so I'm just going to run around the church lot. All right. No helmet, because I'm going slow. Just remember the driveways, and that this battery box is a little lower than the other one, even with the oh, yes. ah. so Keep that in mind, por favor, senor. Oh, I love the handles. I really, really, really love the handles. I think we should paint them to match. Thank you. Because they're kind of beat up. That many cool, please. Oh wow, I need a helmet. So there's the silver there's, helmet. Give me the silver helmet with the red tab on the chin. I want to watch this. The good news is I don't need these. Here, Katie. Can I borrow them? Yeah, you can borrow them. Thank you, because I left mine on my desk. Huh? I'm cool. I just need a brain bucket. Bucket! Thank you. It's going to be the coolest thing I've seen in a Spider check. That's horrifying. <laughs> I know how it ends. <laughs> you put your headrest, aren't you? Huh? It's going to end with it back on the I got a headrest. Oh, no, my problem is it's too loud. I need the helmet for hearing protection more than head protection. I can't believe those are fans. Yeah, it's just an angry hair dryer. We didn't account for the ice either. No, and the. Snow and the ice. Oh, the driveway is low here. Yeah, you want help picking it up? Over grab that? the front end, carry it right over. Here, hold on, hold on. You don't have to grab the back end. Okay. I didn't know if you wanted to get all the battery box and scrape it. You don't want that back end. Go right over in, go right in, go right in. Thank you. Two motors. Wait till we get four. How many volts are they running on? Uh, he's running 22 volts at about 100 amps. There you go. Now he's 
got two big ass batteries. Oh, for God's sakes. Oh. A battery for a motor. Yeah. They're, they're not very small batteries, that's for sure. <laughs> nah, they're not that bad. The the silver tube on the front that's holding the battery. Okay. Hey, I bet you guys get stuff like this all the time. Asking, want to look at it and check it out. That's cool. Here's it listing a little bit. It is leaning a little. I can't tell though if that's the luge. Maybe get up to 45 or more. I can't tell if it's the entire luge or if we have a loose bracket, you know, which could be one or the other. Or you could have a Yeah, it could be two. I mean, it looks like I mean, he did hit a fucking snowbank. Yeah. Kind of went through it. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. Yeah, the, it's the bracket itself is coming loose in some of the Yeah. Yeah. The wings aren't sitting level anymore. Okay. Oh, it looks I, I hit a snowbank. Yeah, bit. I, I just saw. Can you not have at least one flight without a crash? Well, I want to break everything flying. I can at this stage. Well, so far it's holding up. That way you make fine. them strong enough so they don't fail. Well, I was still spinning high and strong. So yeah. Let's. Uh... You can tell I'm definitely down in the battery a bit though. Yeah. It goes quick, I bet, huh? Well, yeah, but it's not designed for this. It was designed for straight line, high speed. Constant. Yeah. I got a lot more twisty in it, though. I'm going to put wheels. his stiffer clouds in it. Yeah, the wheels really changed it. I've, I, it's really easy to kick it into an oscillation. Yeah. And speed wobble plus, you know, cheese grater two inches under your ass is not a good combination. <laughs> oh, so cool. So this test is better. This test definitely went better. We have to fix it. Well, that's how it turns by him leaning sideways. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You want to carry it? Grab it in the middle. Don't grab it back. Yeah, grab. It. Well, whatever. But yeah. Yeah, you do. It's like, it's like you crashed into a snowbank. It's just water, right?
does move a little bit of air. Can it go in reverse or not? No. I wonder what? Can no. it go in reverse? No. Well, I'm going to it. Set them up here on yeah. a nice cold metal pan. <laughs> but everything worked. Everything worked great. Nothing broke as far as things aren't quite as tight as they should be, but nothing broke. We can fix that. Yeah, the handles worked out alright. I like the handles a lot more when I have a throttle level on the handle. I need a throttle level. Alright, let's move it back over to the workbench.